Hello and welcome to this training. I'm going to be showing you how to create a collaborative playlist. So the previous videos on my channel, which you may have seen or may not have seen, are videos on how to delete a video from a collaborative playlist or a playlist or watch later list. But there isn't any video on how to actually create a collaborative playlist. And if you're thinking about creating one, this video will help you and show you how you can do it. It's very easy. And um, yes, I'll just be showing you. So let's get started. I'm using one of my channels. It's an old channel. It's not active. Um, I use it in the past for my testimonials. So the videos are way, way back, like three years, five years ago. Um, so I'm going to be using this channel to show you how to create a list. So you can see that there is no playlist on this channel. Okay. So we're going to go to the videos. And these are my testimonials from way back. You can see how old they are. Um, to create a playlist, you need to use choose a video. You have to start with one video. So I'm going to click these three dot dot buttons here, as you see here. And it says save to a playlist or save to watch later. So we're not saving to watch later. We're creating a playlist. We're going to click save to a playlist. And then here, you know, I've got three playlists here, you know, got watch later, which, you know, is already on your channel. That wasn't created by me. I've got something here. Um, I created some videos I like to listen to every now and then. It's called Tongues of Fire. And then my favorite, which is created by YouTube. So here I click on create a new playlist. So um, here I'm going to name this playlist um, testing. Testing. Should we do testing? What's this month? We're in June. Testing June. <laughs> testing June. So we can choose to make it public or choose to make it unlisted but not private. If you do private, nobody can add to the playlist, okay? If it's unlisted, it won't be public, but only people who have the link will be able to add to the playlist. Um, I would suggest if your first time of creating a collaborative playlist, make it public. It's fine to make it public. Just make it public, and then I'll show you how to make sure that uh, the only the people you intend to add their videos to this playlist will add their videos okay so we'll keep it at public for now and we click create okay so that's created now we're going to go to our playlist and we have testing journey here and we have only one video in it you can see only one video in it so we're going to click on view full playlist because we want to go to the settings and we can see it's only one playlist and then we click on edit only one video, sorry. We'll click on edit. So it opens up. You can see the one video here. Now, the, what you need to do now is go in here, playlist settings, and click. Okay, one minute. Before we click here, if you click the share button, you have a link. It says allow people to add, with, uh, add videos to with this link here. So this link will allow people to add videos, but without the next step I'm going to show you, they won't be able to add videos. They won't be able to add videos because you haven't opened it up or you haven't given them the permission to add the videos. So let me show you how to give permission. So you click there, you have um, auto add public, like I said, you know, you can change it to unlisted, but I would say for your first time, just leave it at public, yeah? And then here you click on collaborate. So this is where you need to give the approval. If you don't open this and make it active, that link which you wanted to share wouldn't work. To the best of my knowledge, if you don't open this up and make it active, it won't work. So now you have collaborators can add videos to this playlist because you have activated it. You know, you've opened it up. Now to invite collaborators to this VM to, to add videos to this link, you have to get your link here. And this is the link you copy. Okay, you copy this link, and this is the link you share to the people that you want. Um, to add their videos to the to the list. So now 
if you have let's say you wanted five people or two people to add their videos to the list and those five have added and you don't want anybody else to add you know you know random person to just come and add videos to your list you click the activate link here so when you deactivate link no one else excuse me no one else will be able to add videos to the list also remember that you need to save whatever you do and when you finish click the save button and it's saved okay so now that i save you've copied your link and now you can share this one if you want to share if you didn't copy the link and share this one and then people can now add their videos to your collaborative playlist and if you don't you know if they don't know how to do it you have other videos i've already created on how to do that they can you can use that and show them what to do um how they can add their videos because people still get confused even when you send them the link they don't know what to do so i've created videos on how to add your videos to a collaborative playlist using your computer and how to do it using your mobile phone and also how to delete because some people after they've added and maybe they need to delete it they don't know how to delete it i've created videos on also how to delete I hope this video helps you. Leave a comment in the comment box. Let me know your thoughts on it. Um, let me know if it helped you. If you have questions, let me know. I'll be happy to assist you. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you on the next training video. Bye for now.